Why can't you let me sleep? What are you doing here anyway? If you've come to play, you have to go above ground. That's where the warlocks live. <laughs> Very odd folk. They could use your help. Yeah, but you won't get in with that silly cursor. Or oh, perhaps you can put this glove on. See? That looks a lot better. But you're not finished yet. If you're only used to clicking, you won't get very far. If you want to come closer, you'll have to point. Give it a try. Keep pressing your mouse button. Move the mouse forwards. That wasn't so hard now, was it? Now take a step back. Your glove will change, so keep an eye on it. If it points backwards, you can go back by pressing your mouse button and pulling the mouse towards you. Did you see that? Your glove was trying to give you a clue. Later, you'll see that it will always try to help you. Keep your mouse button pressed and move to the left. The book will open, just like a real book. Greetings, visitor. Welcome to the country ruled by the masters of the elements. It is a country full of surprises. A friendly country that is fortunately not too big. From the castle of infinity on the peak of the highest mountain, the masters of the elements are responsible for time, gravity, electricity, warmth, light and chance. Each master has a magic ring that controls each of these forces that keep our land in balance. Use your eyes and take the time to look around. Listen well to my advice, because I know what I'm talking about. Something is wrong. My cat has vanished, and all the masters are helping me look for it. But they can't remember what their real jobs are. The magic rings have been left lying around in the castle, and are losing their power, throwing the forces of nature off balance. We desperately need someone to help us. Are you brave enough, are you clever enough to solve the mystery of the missing cat? Then follow me. Enter the story and let the adventure begin. Sometimes you have to help someone before they help you. Good luck. The master of gravity loves paintings. He paints a bit himself, but he doesn't call it that. He's terribly modest.
He likes the Mistress of Light's paintings. Beautiful, charming, beguiling, he says. But does he mean the paintings or the painter? And she can explain it so prettily. It's all about looking with colour, she says. Typical artists talk. Why can't she just say what she means? Boys can play with dolls, and girls with cars and building blocks. The mistress of electricity was already adding and taking away when she was scarcely out of her nappies, even though her mum gave her paper and paints. Look, mum, if I do this, the lift goes up, and if I turn it the other way, it goes down again. But her mother wasn't interested. Yes, dear, she'd say. Amazing. And look the other way.
What's it like here now? Has everything thawed? Or is it still ice cold and is the master of warmth still huddled under his electric blanket? <laughs> 